25% of Africans cannot metabolize that HIV drug. So if there's five of us here, at least one person will take that drug and have terrible side effects. And why is that? It's when that drug was being discovered and being trialed, uh, they did not, the, the, the drug companies did not look at Africans. The drug company did not look at Africans. And so that's what my company um, is solving. And just last year we launched and we raised $4.5 million in seed funding. Now, why were we able to do this? Um, I think it was because the investors who came into our company understand the put, understood the potential for good. Now, one of the things I'd like to say is impact investing is not the same thing as charity. I think In that's fact, a very important um, thing to, to state because, sorry to interrupt, but once, I think impact investing is something that is often talked about, but people don't really understand what it is. People confuse it with CSR, they confuse it with NGOs and things of that sort. So it's a very important distinction to make. In fact, if you want to bring in charity money, uh, as an investor into my company, I probably would say no, because that means there's a misalignment in our values. As a company founder and CEO, I want to do well. I want to make money, right? I want to make to, to be profitable. So that is one of the metrics I'll judge myself by. But at the same time, I want to do good.